Hello friends, welcome to my channel. This is Charan and this is a React.js video tutorial series. Now in this lesson 4 video tutorial, I will explain how to render multiple HTML elements in a React.js class based component. If you are a first time visitor to my channel, please subscribe to get the latest updates. In my previous video, I have shown how to add and render multiple HTML elements using functional component. And the output of this component here is in this browser. Now let's achieve the same thing using the class based component. If you notice here, this is a functional component. Let's create a class based component here. What I'll do is I'm creating a class hello let's extends react dot component after that let's add the curly brackets now this class contains a render function render method now I want to render a return h1 this is charon and make sure add the export default hello our class component name here let's save this file compiled successfully let's check the output see here we got the new output this is charon now if i add another element react.js tutorials let's save this file and after i save this application we got an error this jsx elements must be wrapped in an enclosing tab so to render multiple html tags we need to place inside the do tab so all the tail elements must be in the root fold root element the root element here is a div tag let's save this file and after i save this file notice here i got some warnings here compiled with warnings but you can check here when i reload nothing was written from render To fix this error, we need to put this return method in the parenthesis. All the elements must be in this written between this parenthesis and we must have one parent element, the root element which is a div tag. Now let's save this file, save all. Now we got a message compiled successfully, see here we got the new output this is channel react.js tutorials let's add one more do tag bold render multiple html elements elements with class component Let's save this file, save all, let's check the output again, see here the render multiple HTML elements with class components, that's it. This is how we have to add and render multiple HTML elements in a class based component. Make sure all the child elements must be inside the root, for root element which is a due tag. And we need to add the written function. Thanks for watching and please subscribe my channel. 